We also continue to learn more about the woman who lost her life in the explosion. Brandon Scott joins us live with how Clara Bender is being remembered. John Mallory Chase mentioned that makeshift memorial for Clara Bender. It's right here behind me and it's grown overnight. It started with this uh, rest in peace and a single red rose in just the past couple of minutes. Residents have brought flowers down here on the sidewalk. And then I want to show you this. This is pretty impressive, pretty powerful. There's a fence here along the blast site keeping it secure. And along the fence, you can see these white carnations. A whole bunch of them, all in memory of Clara Bender. Now, as investigators continue to figure out exactly what happened here, trying to piece it together, Clara Bender's family is making their way to the metro from Mississippi. Her mother is expected to arrive this evening with more family members arriving tomorrow, all of them to be here for Clara Bender's husband and young son. Everyone has a hard time sleeping last night. I think we all... Like when somebody passes away, you like this, you just imagine that you're so, so lucky to be able to put your head on your pillow. She can't. Jeremy Aspen was Clara Bender's boss at Certified Property Management. Bender was a home inspector and was surveying the house on 65th Street when it exploded. The tenants were recently evicted, and Aspen wants to know whether the blast was an accident or if foul play was involved. We will help in every way possible to pursue anybody that may have done it or just to find out an answer. And to help with that investigation, Clara Bender's company has turned over to authorities property records and maintenance records for this specific property where the explosion occurred. Still so many unanswered questions out here tonight, but one thing is certain, John and Mallory, the family. Terrible loss. That's Brandon Scott reporting for us live tonight. Thank you, Brandon. Well, the family of Clara Benda is expected to release a statement tomorrow.